sad, sad morning. Leaving the bow tie at home. Taking the old girl. The old girl. Until next time, sweetheart. Look at this though. That's bad. I need to clean this. That's really bad. Look who beat me to work today. Beat me to work. What are you doing in there, Jake? What you doing, buddy? Chilling in the Tahoe? It's probably sleeping down there. Guesses in the comments. What's Jake doing in the Tahoe down there at 7.30 in the morning, beating me to work? Uh, I saw, I saw Austin again today at Chick-fil-A. Hello, Austin. Hope you and the girlfriend are doing fantastic. I'm definitely doing better now. I got my Chick-fil-A. I was on the way to work this morning, and I was uh, thinking about, dang, I should really talk about this in the vlog today. Because I feel like what the vlogs do is give you guys a little bit of insight into my, my mindset during the day. The good, the bad. Normally when we're doing these videos, all we're filming is the trucks. All we're filming is the, the nice builds that come through and you know things like that. The vlogs force me to come up with more content. And it forces me to really give more insight into my mind and how my day is going all the time. So, uh, it's Tuesday and uh, we're trying to plan, uh, we're going to Miami this weekend, trying to plan this trip. Jake is staring at me behind the camera because he got to work early this morning and uh, it's not messing up this grind over here. Um, and I want to give you guys a little bit of a quote. Um, where can we get a fucking blowing blower motor? I'm trying to put one in the top. Okay, well, um, completely threw me off guard. Jake was staring at me behind the camera. We're going to Miami. Um, Jake, not Jake, Drake. <laughs> Drake, I was listening to a Drake song this morning and Drake said, all these chase uh, looking for the crumbs, where the bread at? Mood, it's mood, mood today, mood today. Let's get this bread. Can Caden hop in the truck with him? Trash. Trash. Did he hop in the truck with you? Yeah. What the hell are you doing, Caden? Just chilling, man. Starlight headliner. I've been. I got a chauffeur now. It is cool though, actually. The fuzzy steering hey, wheel. Well, you uh, got you on the right. He just called me. Yeah. Caden's dropping that thing. The squat box. It's already squatted. What are you talking about? It's already squatted. Look at it. You just wanted it to squat more? Yeah. Looks good though. One last time. One last time. I don't believe we it. Going one, two. I told you to do two. Stop babysitting and just squat the damn thing. It's gonna look good. It's got Chauncey. Get some nuts. <laughs> See it? You need the key spring. I got you on the list. Hold it now. You're gonna do something. What is what is this? Man, I knew you. I didn't know you were hanging like that. You know? Dragging the floor. <laughs> Dragging the floor with it, huh? Yeah. Put tuck in my Dude, sock. Tuck that thing in your boot, look. I ain't gonna knock it. That's a nice shaft. I ain't normal. <laughs> Need a rubber band. That's a nice shaft. You better you better watch that joint down there. Need a rubber band. You're gonna hurt somebody. <laughs> I got a zip tie out there. <laughs> tough wheels. Root cheese. Remember these tucks. We just got the drive shaft in for Chauncey's truck today. Are you putting that drive shaft in? Is that what you're back here doing? I'm back here getting my game plan together. Getting your game plan? 
All right, I'll let you. I'll let you do some scheming, and I'll come back and see. Okay, now don't look no different. I do see the squat though. You want to know where I see the squat the most, Caden? Is the front looks taller now. The front definitely looks taller now. Do what? You're gonna take the blocks out too? <clears throat> Can I ask you a question? Why is this student driver card just freaking chilling right here? Like looking at me all weird. It's the owner. I don't know. Ready to fist fight. I that one right on the squad of the truck. But you know, ready, I'm, I'll, I'll fist fight. I see the squad now, 100%. I think they're waiting on us. I was waiting on them. Awkward. Yeah, the factory blocks. I see it now. The, the 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 gap between the fender and the wheels more now. That's where that's where I see it the most. Yeah. How you feel to be a squatty boy now? You got to tilt your hat down now. You got to tilt your hat more, right? No, you got to do this. You gotta tilt your hat more. Now we look. Now we looked apart. Yeah. You getting some reps, bro? Yep, I am 26 D13. So I got reps in stock. I'm glad you your sixes and sevens. You wanna take the blocks out? Yeah, two inch blocks. If we take the blocks out, Patrick blocks will my out. fender sit in between the tread blocks of the tires? You'll be thugging. Be thugging? Yeah. Am I obligated to stick my hand out the window and wave goodbye to everybody yeah, you got now? Going down the road. I can't even see your face with how low my hat is. Yeah. I'm just looking at your chest. You got his off on? I'll walk around like this. My neck back. Okay. My neck's about to start hurting. <clears throat> wheels for trade, sixes and sevens, cash on your end. You keep these wheels pretty clean though. Proud of you. That's awesome. Proud of you. Squat life. Don't drive to Virginia. Stay out of the Carolinas. Stay out of the Carolinas. No, I'm going as soon as y'all get done. Go get. You better be careful out there. I'm going back. You better... Yeah, you, you can tow your own truck. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> Just see that crap that squats now illegal in Virginia and the Carolinas. It's crazy out here in these streets. Trailer. No. That's not good. That's no. Damn. Nope. Yours are coming off FedEx. I really want to see your 355s. Nah, Leonard's getting the same tire as me, just a little bit smaller. Not in a bad way, but I, I haven't really ever seen the 355s in person. Dang. We do got some 40s up here for somebody, though. <clears throat> P.O. Alex. Oh, I know what this is. How? Where are we going today? Hey. Come here. What? See you, kids. How? What, what would you say to the FedEx guy if he started talking shit? Here, here we go. <laughs> Have a good one. Oh, wait. No, they're not. Yeah, no, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not. There's only three, though. Oh. You're lying. Yeah, you, you took the fourth one off already. You're lying. Oh, You're lying. It's only three. It's only three. Damn it, man. <laughs> you're, you're bad like me. I only got one and I had to wait for the other three. Hell yeah. Look at that right there. There's really no difference. A Chevrolet 1500? 355-4024s. Or GMC, I should say. Same shit. What is it? All right, look, look. So what does it say on the side though? 35 14 50. Dang. You better get on it. <laughs> He's going in the office, okay? Jordan! <laughs> Those look good. Those look real good. Right, right? I'm not why Bow Tie on campus anymore, huh? No! <laughs> I ain't no Bow Tie. I'm that wide Sierra. That wide Sierra. There's like five people on Instagram with that name. Yeah. You're gonna have to come up with something better. I got it. Blue Thunder. Blue Thunder? Yeah. That wide Blue Thunder? Look at this. Legendary Strikes Mobile Bowling Alley. Look at this. 
Can we can we go on to it? Did y'all go in there? Yeah, we walk in. We walk in. Look at this. That's cool. Do some bowling. A little lounge up here. That's nice. It's cool. Look, got a little TikTok light. A little TikTok light. A little bowling alley action. That's cool. Do not cross foul line. Oh, thank you. Well, that's cool. I wonder if it's little small balls or is it big balls? Just a regular. <laughs> that's cool. I want to thank you guys. We're five subscribers away from 27,000. So I just, you know, want to say thank you to you guys. Uh, the response on the daily the daily videos has been pretty good. You know, I'm, I'm super surprised that a, they're not surprised, but just super grateful that so many of you have been liking it and surprised too, because last time I did this, it, you know, it, I had good days and bad days. Most of them have been good days. You know, even if the videos aren't to where I would want them to be, the goal is to put out content every day and you guys are still loving it and I appreciate you guys more than anything. I'm taking up a lot of time. I gotta go get lunch to everybody, so I'm gonna speed up. Why are you making that face? Got some woods I wanna open up today. Got a 24 by 12 KG1. Um, shout out to Jake for making it all nice and pretty for when we unbox this. He wanted specifically to do that. Today we got a 24 by 12 KG1 vial. Have we done an eight lug vial yet? Um, you know what? I didn't realize this was. Uh, hopefully the truck's also an eight lug. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess. Uh, no, it is. Is it? It's a uh, 2500. This is a Chevy. actually 2022. GMC 2500 Denali. It's getting a nine inch Magoy's kit. Uh, these right here are 24 by 12s. That's gonna get some 38 inch Toyo MTs. Nice, look, we got the, uh, the shallow cap. All of the KG1s are coming with this new shallow cap, which is super nice. Um, no, nothing against the fact that this is a plastic cap. I've just, every time I see a cap now, I, I do that. No. Your face was in the center cap. Was it? Yeah. It looked good. Not really. It was all right. I like the eight lug better and I like the six lug. Yeah, the vial comes in a six lug and it's got six spokes instead of the eight. And I actually really like the, uh, the eight lug better. Yeah, it does look good. To be 100% honest with you. As a joke to Jake, I'm gonna throw this in. I got a set of 26 by 12 Forgiatos in stock for one of you guys. If you guys want some uh, they can Forgiatos. 4,000 bucks a vial right now. 4,000, out the door. 20, 26 by 12 Chevy six lug. Line. We'll put some adapters on for a Ford, I don't care. 26 by 12 Forgiatos in stock for you. These one of like you. The TXC, I, the numbers maybe like a 103, but. One of them, they're fire, so I don't care. Come buy them, come shop, $4,000. Very, uh, very nice. You guys saw me freaking out. So Leonard just got his uh, 355 4024s, and you guys are probably gonna wonder, wow, did he get the same setup as Alex? Um, close. So Leonard's got the uh, the kind of bluish, greenish GMC. Um, he's nicknamed it Blue Thunder. I think he went with the 355 4024 Trail Grappler. So mine's a 375 40. Mine's a 36 by 15. His is a 35 by 1450. So very close in size. Um, I think his are a little bit cheaper actually, not taking anything away from that tire, but just in case you guys were wondering, the smaller tire is gonna be a little bit cheaper. And then he went with the 24 by 12 Ford Giotto Fluso instead of the 24 by 14. You guys know I had to go 14 wide, I had to go 375. You know, that's that's the whole goal of the truck, that was the whole plan. Um, Leonard has a little bit of a different taste, he didn't wanna go 12 wide, he likes a little more tire on the sidewall, so obviously that's why he went with that over the uh, the 14 wides and the 375s. But they're going on, a, he's got a six inch BDS and he might, I think if he stops babysitting and he stops playing around and he's being serious, he's got a six inch BDS that's coming in that he's gonna get powder coated burnt orange to go we'll with be that. Here today. Do what? We'll be here today. Look, it will be. Yeah. I don't know if he's doing burnt orange, that'll be really nice. So. Nice. Flusos, four Giottos, in stock, $4,000. Come shop. Not these. Looking for lunch. like a bowl of money. Look at that cab though. Yeah, that's a nice looking cab. What's for lunch? Let me guess. Chick-fil-A. Speaking of that. Chick-fil-A. You can probably hear my stomach growling. Chick-fil-A. Speaking of that, hey Alex. Chick-fil-A. You know you've been working really hard in your van here? Chick-fil-A. You have lunch in Hell yeah, really? Do I really? Hell yeah. <laughs> Got something in my beard. Freak yeah. Freak yeah. Recover from that. Heck yeah. Heck you, heck you. <laughs> We're getting weird, I'm going to Chick-fil-A. Right. Do that thing. What? It's been a couple days. Bro, this color is crazy though. 
Did they tell you what, what the name of this color was? Looks like a like a burnt orange with like a like a like a like a bunch of sparkle. It's um Sebring orange. Sebring orange with the little blue accents. What year is this? Twenty one. Nineteen. So a twenty nineteen. So last year they made the C seven. Twenty nineteen Chevy C seven Corvette ZR one. Absolutely insane. It's got all the carbon fiber. That's real carbon fiber too. Ain't no it, fake over here. It's really dirty right now, but when it's clean, you the matching can see, calipers. You can see the carbon fiber has gold in it. Does it really? Like all the carbon fiber? Yeah. Like gold That's flake? Is it like gold flake in it? I think so. Oh, I can see it. Yeah, you can see it in the sun, in the light. You can see the the reflection has the reflection has some has some like goldish orange to it. on the bow tie. I like that color. Oh, with the lights. That's mean. It's really my first time seeing a ZR1. Back again, FTS, 2614 Forgiatos. Red FTS, chrome reservoir shocks up top, chrome Forgiatos with the floating caps. Beautiful, beautiful. The truck turned out great, it really did. I like it. Tahoe came in on stocks. This thing's actually kind of riding. Look at this. It's actually kind of riding. Whoa, look how close that is back there. That's some squat right there. Don't hit a bump. You good? You good, yeah. Squeak City. 2614 Tufts and the 37 inch Gladiators. Scrubbing a little bit. I'd just come this way with it. Is this yours? It's yours? It looks good, actually. Look at that thing leaning. Dang. I actually kind of like it. Thing looks good. Finished up a McGoy's kit on this 2020 Denali 2500. It's been a uh, black Denali 2500 kind of kind of week. Got the black McCoy's kit. Got the traction bars down here with the accents. One of the coolest things about the uh, 2500 kits, in my opinion, is McCoy's puts the accents. McCoy's puts the accents on the torsion drop plate as well. 
we got some 26 by 14 uh, set of used 26 by 14 Archons and some uh, some new Fury MTs. I think it turned out great. Did a seven inch lift, 26, 14s and 35s. Not too much trimming that has to be done. Most of the mud flap has to come off, but this is a way for you guys to see that the mud flap can stay on there, that bottom piece. So some people want it, some people don't, but I think it turned out great. So you guys can see a finished product. Another one in and out, hell yeah. Leonard told me to grab the camera, come outside. Look at this time, it's like two and a half boxes. Yeah. Look at All this. You Look at the spindle's like a four inch this spindle. This looks like some stuff that you went and grabbed out of the really? dumpster, a dumpster a little while ago. Work, so buddy. BDS is the best. What they say. Yeah. Let me see these box shocks you're talking about. Oh, the struts are in there, right there. Nah, it looks like McGoy's. Nah. It ain't McGoy's. Is this, that's funny kit right here. Let me find it. Looks like McGoy's. Shock absorber. McGoy's. Yep. Did they give you Fox stickers? Not real Fox, no. Oh, in that box, buddy. You, know. you can see the real box. Nah, I don't believe it. Big ass in. Yeah. Open that shit up. Yeah, okay. You know, I got some on my truck too. Yeah, but you got a shitty McGoy. Dang. Shot is fired, McGoy. I'm bleeping you out. I'm having to bleep you out now. Fucking Ted needs to hurry up and come get my powder coat. Now I'm ready to see it. Babe, babe, put that bay one. Bay one. BS, no fine print. <laughs> no fine print. Day number eight. How do you feel? I feel uh, I feel like these should be on sale on Instagram. They should be. Day number eight. Day number eight thousand for me, bro. It's gotta be. It's gotta be like day number four thousand for me. I don't believe you. Not one bit. You gotta put in your work. That's what it is. We're gonna put a lift kit on this gladiator. Tahoe. We're gonna go look at that truck tomorrow with the Red McGoy's kit. Got some news for Slick Vic. Go check out that, uh, that wide JT thing. On a real note, they made a bunch of good progress on Chauncey's truck today. Um, and I'm pretty sure that it will be driving tomorrow. We're doing wheels and tires on it tomorrow. So, big day for Chauncey's truck tomorrow. It's about to be a big day for uh, Vic's truck too. Slick Vic's about to, about to make some big moves too. So. He called me today and said we got the truck as long as we need it. Really? He's not coming to get it? He's not coming. So he wants to just go ahead and... So the next time that truck is really shown on the channel, it'll be a monster. It'll be a monster. Is, there, is it going to be a surprise build? All right. It's kind of going that way anyways. Day number eight. Let's get his bread.